Hello, and in this video, you'll learn to create this image carousel, which changes an image with a transition every few seconds automatically. Let's begin the video. Welcome back to our series of creating a React application with Vite and Tailwind CSS. In this part, we'll be adding an image carousel. First thing we'll do is go to our app component and create an images array. So const images equals array. In here, we'll add all the images. I'll only have two. You can add as many as you like. Next, we can say import mist from dot slash mist assets slash mist dot jpg. You'll be importing your own images. Mine is just called mist. And we can say forest mist. Next, we'll create a use state. First, we'll need to import it. This will hold the current image that we have. So, use state snippet. In here, we can say background image and set the default value as images zero. So basically by default, the image will be the first element in the array. In this case, our forest image. And over here, instead of saying forest, we can say background image. Now we only have one thing left to do. That is make that animation and make the change every couple seconds. First of all, let's look at how this looks now and if there are no errors and if we can actually change the image manually. Let's go over here and there seems to be no errors. And if we change it to images one, the image does change to this one. For our current part, we'll need a use effect hook. So under the use state, we can say use effect. To brackets, essentially creating a callback function inside the use effect and say, let current index equals zero. Then create a function changing the current index, change background image equals, this is an arrow function, saying current index equals current index plus one, then the percentage sign, which, will, which means the remainder of the division by a certain number, and that certain number will be images dot length. This will ensure the constant flow of the carousel. Quite an interesting thing. And finally, we can say set background image to the current, actually to the images with the current index. So the Constantly, when this function is running, the index will change a meaning. The current image will also change. We'll also need an interval. So const interval equals set interval. Change background image. So what we want to change and what happens every certain interval and saying 5,000. 5,000 is in milliseconds and it is five seconds in real time. Finally, we can have a return statement with an arrow function in it saying clear interval, interval. We want that so that every time this use effect runs, meaning every time the image changes, we want the interval to be zero once again. So you can change every five seconds. Only one part left is the transition. In this div, 
we can say. Um, over here in the style part, transition 1s, like this. If we go back to our website, there should be a transition and change of images every few seconds. The first one was a laggy. Let's see if the next ones are more smooth. And yes, now every five seconds, we have a one second long transition. In the case that we want to change the interval between transitions, we'll simply change this. If we want to change the duration of the transition, we'll change this. So for example, we change it to three seconds. Now the transition will be longer and smoother, essentially. First one was a little buggy. The next one should be smooth. As you can see, the transition is much slower. So yeah, this was the image carousel for the website. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.